Hey, welcome back to my Charlie B's. What's popping, y'all? What's good? Do y'all got y'all shot? You got your shot? Okay. Let's give it because I'm giving it to you straight. If you want to do a chaser, so be it. Do you? So anyway, I just want to jump right in. It's not a long video. Y'all know that I've been rocking with Wild Growth ever since um my hair fell out. I've been rocking with them since like the middle of August. Every month I buy a bottle because I go through it once a month. You know what I mean? Wild Growth is running about no more than $10. I'm saying 10 because of the fact that where I go is $7.99 plus tax because it comes up to like $8.50. But then you got some places that might try to play it close and it might be a little bit more. You know what I mean? So this is my Wild Growth. So y'all remember, I would never stop using Wild Growth. I will always use Wild Growth. So um, y'all also know that when it comes to my edge control, bam, that's what it is. It's called Eben or Eben. I don't know if you want to check it out and see if it's good for you because it's good for me. And you got to remember, y'all, when y'all put edge control in your hair, right, and you trying to, like, slick your hair down and around like that, you can't just put a glob right there and don't think that that shit not going to flake up. You got to you gotta form that shit. You know what I'm saying? You got to form it. So, Evan is good to me. It don't leave me flaky. It don't leave me nothing. But I was going to go through the journey of how I first got introduced to it, which was on my own. I seen it and I was like, oh, I think this is more good for me. It's a 24-hour edge tamer. I was like, extreme firm hold. I was like, oh, that's me. I need that. And I've just been rocking with it ever since then. And that's since been 2017. So, at one time, they tried to call themselves going up on Eben or Eben, whatever the fuck it's called. And I went and I bought this. Touchdown. $4.99. They took this up to $7.99. I was not paying $7.99 plus tax. I was not paying that for this bottle. Is you out of your goddamn mind? So, eventually, I found another store that carries it now. And it's still stuck at $4.99. But like I said, I used to get it for $3.79. But they see a lot of people starting to use it. Okay, anyway, I'll be following this. Um, Not following her, but if her channel shows up. If her channel shows up on my, um, on my news feed. When I go on YouTube, because sometimes I go in there and I go and check my channel and I'll be like, let me go see how my channel doing. You know what I'm saying today or whatever. So when um when I go on there, if she got a video up, you know, I watch her video. But everybody hair that I seen her deal with, they all got short hair like curves. Um, she did do somebody hair that was long, but it was like shoulder length long. And actually, it was a little bit past her shoulder like this much. And she took all of that off. I was like, I like her and I know how she like she's all about not just making that bread, but she's all about trying to teach you about your hair and how you can tell this and how you can tell is that with certain things that you know if she can help you with or whatever so um i was like i like her i said but i wouldn't never go to her even if i lived in the area that she lived in because she too scissor happy for me she cuts too much a trim for her would probably be like oh i need my ends clipped even if you say you need your ends clip, that's still to me like a trim. But if you say I need my ends clip, they taking off at least this much, y'all. They don't. They, I'm saying, y'all, they get the fucking, yo, when they get them shears in their hand, it's like they can't stop. It's like they be like, oh, more, more, oh, more, 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 more. So, I only person that I've been dealing with is this one girl, but she went and moved away and she came back 
So I told her, I was just like, I just need, I said, you know how I am about my hair. I don't want a lot of it taken off. I said, just take the dead pieces off so that my hair can stop splitting. Cause she gave me a trim before, but I need another one because um, y'all know that I damaged my hair by using that, um, that, um, got to be. Yeah, I damaged my hair with that, guys. Y'all, y'all, like, yeah, I was using that shit on my own hair when it's only for lace wigs. So, I was like, all my hair fell out in the back. Like, like all this was gone, y'all. And I've been using my wild growth. So, Tonight or later when I come in, I'm going to um, wash my hair. And like I told you, the girl that I've been following and stuff, one thing I do like is that she breaks down. Like as far as, because people, when she go live, some sometimes she'll answer some questions. And they was talking about hair density. And she was saying how, see, I don't know what my hair density is, but she said how you can do it to see what your hair density is. So she was saying, always have like a, um, she said, always have like a hydrating shampoo. So I found this. It's a hydrating shampoo with pro vitamin B5 B5 and avocado oil because she was like get a hydration shampoo she just kept saying hydration shampoo hydration shampoo so i was like you know what let me see if i can find me a hydration shampoo so i got that and um and that's my shampoo right there yo and it's so crazy because i bought this bottle one time before but i i don't know for some reason i, I just i don't know why i never bought went back and got it it's by Silky and, Silky and's Hair Care. So, and it's a nice size bottle. So, this should last me. And then I want to show y'all this right here. I got this right here. Um, This is my um conditioner that I bought. They didn't have the conditioner to match the shampoo that I just showed y'all. So this is Daily Defense Coconut Oil, um, sulfate free, sand sulfate, whatever. Um, I just love stuff that got coconut oil. Coconut oil. Let me show y'all. Oops, can y'all see? There you go. Coconut oil is good for your hair. Very good for your hair. Very good for your hair. So um, I'm about the um. I just wanted to show y'all that, you know, that, you know, when I get into something, it's two things right now that is, is taking up my, my head space, learning to do nails and repairing my hair right now. So y'all know I'm always keep it. I'm always keep it real with y'all and let y'all know, like, look, I'm still repairing my hair and I'm always check in with y'all. Or if I'm starting to use another product, which that is a different product, because um, I know y'all seen um, the other one that I was using. I still got it. And you know what? Hold on, guys. Hey, y'all, my chili bees. I'm back. Okay, y'all. Y'all know that I've been using, my dude bought me this. This has coconut oil and shea butter in it. And it's a hydrating shampoo. Check it out. Hydrating shampoo. Restores moisture to dry, damaged hair to promote shiny, healthy looking hair with biotin. So y'all can see that. Okay, so I knew I was low. That's why I went and I bought those two right there. But to be honest with you, if I could find this, this came as a set. It would be nice. My um dude bought it for me. And then look at this one, y'all. It's more, it's more in here, the conditioner. 
Because I do use a lot of shampoo in my hair. I'm not on front, y'all. Even when I do dishes, I use a whole bunch of um, dish detergent. My dude be like, damn, baby, we'll do a whole bottle. I'll be like, listen, I ain't trying to hear that shit. I'll buy another fucking bottle. Fuck it. You know what I'm saying? So, 100% extra virgin. Come on, now. I want to make sure y'all in there. 100% extra virgin coconut oil and shea butter repair hydrating conditioner. You see that? Restores moisture to dry, damaged hair, and to promote shiny, healthy-looking hair with biotin. Free from sulfates. Now, if you see in these shampoos that saying free from sulfate, when you get a shampoo, I don't care how much it costs, cheap or high, you read that bitch. What's in there? Okay, you free from sulfates, we good. But, yeah. This is what I had wanted to show you. Ow. So, what I'm going to do is, oh, I love these right here, y'all. I'm greedy. I'm the type to be like, I mix the coconut oil in with the purple bottle that I just showed y'all. But I ain't going to do that because, you know, I always be extra, even with my perfume. I'm like, so, yeah, this is the shampoo that I've been using. So, now I got some other stuff. So, we good. So, yeah, I just wanted to show that to y'all. And I wanted to show y'all that, you know, I'm still on that journey, man. I'm still on that journey. And when the journey stops when my hair start breaking off. But every day, like, you know, my hairdresser said... You're going to use a few strands. But no woman should be able to put their hand on their hair and pull out hair. So I know I, I'm still on my thing fell. I'm still on my journey. How does that look, guys? Do I got it? I look in the back. Do I have it? Any lumps? You see any lumps? Oh, I wonder if I should put it high. You know how to get a bitch bad, don't you? I don't know. I don't. I know how to get a bitch mad, don't I? Back, back, back it up. Yo, y'all, I seen Cardi B whole concert. Somebody um, videoed it in Nigeria. Oh, man, she was killing it on that stage, guys. She was killing it. And I'm not going to do much to my hair. I'm just going out to go see. I just got to run an errand. That's all. I got to run an errand. And I'm the type that I don't give a fuck where the fuck I'm going at. When I step out, I'm going to step out right. And also, um, you always want to try to keep root to tip moisturized. Always because oh come on because um when your hair dry out and especially if your hair is already breaking off it's gonna your ends is gonna be easy to break off if your hair is not If your hair don't stay moisturized and you already have breakage, it's it's not good. Um, always try to keep your hair moisturized, no matter if you have breakage or not, and you still and you trying to, you know, keep you know do your best you can do to keep your hair, you know, to to make it better. 
Now, this is a shea butter tea tree oil moisturizer. Um, it's an organic conditioner. So, what I'm going to do is, is, you know what? It's really, like, creamy. Look at that. This is the first time I opened this, guys. I, I just bought it. But I'm trying to think. It says, strength is weak, damaged hair, restores nutrients, and moisturizes, prevents dullness, and improves shine. That's one thing I can say about these products. My hair be glistening. I'm trying to be ready, y'all, because my man coming to get me at 2.30. So I can go see see this. Um, I got to go. Uh, I got to go two places, matter of fact. I gotta go to this jewelry store, one of these places. Cause I want this guy, this boy. Well, he's a young man. Back, back, back it is up. I'm the king of talking shit, baby. That's what's up. Cause I was getting some hair, getting some hair. Yeah, like when it come down to all we like here. If see if y'all see my look, a hair. A, a professional hair dresser will be able to be like, yeah, she need her ends clipped. So, then I put just a little bit of gel so that my hair won't, you know, get um frizzy in the back to keep it look moisturized. And when I do that, it gives it like a deep wave, the, the end piece. And then I clip this up, guys, right there. Start putting my hair products back. Uh, so um, tomorrow, um, I might put the put a video out as far as me washing my hair because I'm washing my hair tomorrow. Or either today, I'm not sure. I'm just like taking some baby hairs out. Something very simple because I'm not gonna be out that long. But I still like the little cute, you know. You know, as ladies, you know we like to look. Y'all know we like the little cute. For real. I need and that when. Y'all, let me tell y'all, they just sent the warning to our phone. High winds and some other shit. So, I'm like, oh, I come in the bathroom. I'm like, woo, that wind kicked up. Like, you can hear it. So, I'm like, like, we got a real bad draft in our, in our, um, in our bathroom. We got a real bad draft. And I just went inside my bedroom and it's fucking hot as shit in there. I know how to get a bitch mad, don't I? You know how to get a bitch mad. Back, back, back it is up. Only got a couple dollars, so I hope my dude don't be thinking I'm gonna buy him something. Cause that's not popping. And um, I use the bathroom so much, y'all, that sometimes hair goes down the sink. And um, I've been having to buy Drano and shit. Cause if I don't buy my dude, to be like, your hair going down the sink. That's why the sink acting like that. So I went and I bought some Drano, y'all, but that's what it's still going down slow. It said put half the bottle in there, and it's still going down slow. And the other one that I was going to get when I went to the hardware store, they wanted like $15. But he was like, yo, it really, really works. He was like, you got to move the thing that's in the middle of the sink. And I tried to do that yesterday. It, that motherfucker was not moving. I was like, well, how the fuck if I was to buy the stuff, like, because he was like, you got to move it. And I'm saying to myself, how the fuck am I going to move it if it don't want to come detached? Because eventually, 
I'm going to have to go out and get another bottle, y'all, because the bottle that I've got now, that shit, like I said, it already, for the first time, it told me to put half the bottle in there. So, here go my even, y'all. My even. I love my even. I love my even. Yeah. So, anyway, I told my dude, <coughs> <coughs> I told my dude, make sure you come and get me, because whenever we go to the movie, man, he don't know how to pick no movies out for me, but he makes sure he get the motherfucking action movies. I like action horror, but I'm I like horror, and he don't know how to pick out no good horror movies for me. So I told him you gotta pick me up. Plus, not only that, he ain't trying to have to buy no movies. He want me to use my money because he probably think I got a bunch of money, but I ain't got shit but a couple dollars. I went out yesterday, y'all. I went out and bought me a couple outfits because, like, I literally, y'all, ain't have but one, two, three. I literally had only three three long sleeve shirts because all my other long other all my other long sleeve shirts, guys, I can't even fit them because I can't wait. So it was like when wintertime came back in, it was like I had to um it was like I had to go and rebuy new shit. So now listen y'all, y'all guys like I started off being a mother at a very early young age, right? And <laughs> I remember back in the day when it didn't matter what time of year it was, you could put stuff on layaway. Do y'all know that they don't really do layaways like that unless it's around a holiday? And I think it's only good for like one month, which that's all I need. So let me tell y'all the story. I went to um Walmart, right? They had a 32-inch TV in there. And I was like, I want that TV. But I was like, I don't want to be broke. So I'm thinking, like, I asked the girl, I said, well, can I put that TV on there? Well, she was like, yeah, she said, but you got, it. and this was like around December, no later than like December 5th. So I was like, um, I'm going to put that TV, that 99, 90, it was like $9.99 for this TV. 32 inch flat screen TV. So I was like, oh, it's only $9.99.99. I was like, let's see, let's find out. So when we went to the electronic department to the register, we asked the person that worked there. They talk about, they don't even know about the layaway. When I did retail, y'all. <laughs> Anybody that was as far as a register that worked a cashier, a, res a cash register, or a department knew about the, the rules of layaway. That was that to me was weird. But anyway, we had to walk all the way to the other fucking side of the motherfucking um. We had to work all walk all the way over to the other side of the motherfucking store just to fucking go ask somebody about layaway. Like, what's the rules? Is it good for like a month? Cause I was gonna put half the money down. And then next month I was gonna put the other half down. When I went back there, that bitch told me she said it had to be like between the first and the third that I went. She was like, oh, yeah, we do layaway, but you got to have it off by the 8th. I said, the 8th for what? 
She was like, December. I said, oh, so I can only get it laid away for a week? I was like, you know what? That's all right. I said, that's all right. Whoop, 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 whoop. That's all right. So, my dude, he went, made a couple moves, and came back with the TV. But... It wasn't the same exact day. It was probably like a week later or something like that. So what happened was he went back to the same Walmart that we went to. Because where we seen the 99.99 TV. Don't you know that the girl was like, that TV ain't on sale no more. He was like, he said, this bitch. She's he, he said she trying to sell sell me a motherfucking TV for like one eighty nine one seventy nine. I said what the fuck? Cause we had a thirty two inch y'all. One day we came in the house and the shit just stopped working. I don't even know why. I don't even know. Like, can y'all hear that when? crazy yeah he was like he was like babe that bitch was trying to get me to buy 179 uh -uh, I ain't had that so she was like the girl was saying um well the TV that you want it's not on land it's not that price no more whatever so let me tell you how my dude was like man fuck this motherfucking store he was like don't you know he went to another um, Walmart and found the TV for $99.99 still? He came home with that TV. He was like, hey, babe. He was like, look what I got. I'm like, oh, okay, okay. I'm like, okay, okay. That's my babe. That's my babe. That's my babe. That's my babe. But it was so funny because he was like, she said he was trying to get me to buy all those other specific TVs. He was like, what the fuck? I said, that's how they do. You know what I'm saying? I don't know that. I don't know if y'all know that now, but if you work in the electronic department, you get a piece of the commission of what anybody buys in the electronic department. <sighs> Been on retail for years. You know? You know, you know, you know, you know, you know. Okay, guys, just a basic sit down, sleep back ponytail of my own hair. And um, now I'm going to put my scarf on my head to lay my edges permanently down. I love this scarf, but I only, I don't sleep in it, I only use it. To after I've done my hair, after I like take my bath or my shower, and then I take it off. So. But I just wanted to share that with y'all. And um, you know, you can leave me a comment down below. Let me know how I'm doing. You know, if you want, and you know, if you got something you would like to share with me. So. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Bop, bop, bop. And don't forget Instagram, Charlie, C H A R L I E, 6070. Facebook, Charlie, be more careful. Hit me up, guys. Follow me. Watch some of my videos. Love y'all.